No, I'm, I was very amazed and very happy and very shocked. I, my, my good friend Zoe Radley Azupade, or as I call her Zoe Sapato, she made a video. Crazy woman. Uh, when I make a video, I, as you can see, hands free. I don't play with the phone when I'm driving. Uh, I do, uh, I guess, the safety business. I need the safety first and blah, blah, blah. But this crazy woman, <laughs> she, she jumped on a, a moped or motorcycle, I don't know what the hell it was. And she held the phone in her hand, riding down the street at, I don't know, 80 kilometers an hour. Uh, saying, hey, Christian Wedding! This one is for you! You see? And it was raining, pouring down the rain. I said, wow! Uh, brave woman! Uh, even, even evil kid evil would have done that. You know, you know, even he had his limits. He said, yeah, come on. So I have to take my hat off in respect and say, well done, woman. Uh, it was uh, very enjoyable to watch. It's a pity. It wasn't a, it, it, it's a pity. It wasn't a lot longer. You know, we should, we should have made it a little bit, a little bit, a little bit longer. And then we'll have all enjoyed it. I would have wanted to see maybe a couple of somersaults or some kind of, I don't know, uh, drifting or something. At the end of the road, that would be even more spectacular. Then I would have laid down, I would have been in awe. I would have said, woman, you're a hard fall. But uh, hey, we will start somewhere. And uh, we have a really deep respect for uh, And she's got more courage than most of us have. Uh, well, that's, that's what was that? That was that was yeah. That's of course. He led me on to another thing. Uh, now she so rightly she, she wrote that uh, she was tired of a musical playlist and uh, she needed ideas and input from other people as to uh, what songs she should make and put on a new playlist. Now, I have been a DJ, radio DJ for actually since I was driving. I DJing and stuff, so I do know my music, or I, well, I used to, I don't follow so much modern music, it's too much boom, 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 and it's too much rap, 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 rap music there, and it's not, it's not quite my taste. So I'm more into the 80s and the 90s music, and um, it's, uh, I know it's old school, yes, yes. So I decided, I said, okay, I'll help you out to make your playlist. Oh, what a mistake it to make. Uh, that's... I'm thinking I'll be making my play, I'm making her a playlist, a Zomi Sapato playlist. Uh, my problem is not finding songs. No, no, no. My problem is, is that so many songs. There's so many great songs. I think I've got to have this one. I've got to have that artist. You know, I, I, I even made a list here. I was, you know, planning. I, I, I thought, you know, every time you have, I think of a new name, then I think of another name. And I think, oh, we've got to have them. I've got a band, I've got this band, and suddenly this playlist is so ridiculously long. Now I've come to the, the hard part, and I've got to like, uh, remove half of them. And it's so painful because uh, half of them, you think, oh, I like this song, I like that, I was like, oh, cool, she would like this, she would like it, oh, but what do we take with you? What do, what do you? What do you add? What do you remove? And it's, it's not easy, you know, uh, music is, that's, that's the beauty of music. And there's so much music, there's so much great music and there's so many different uh, musical directions, there's so many different uh, musical moods, there's so many different uh, things which uh, you, you, you could add, you know, all, as I said, beat of music is all, it's in the, in, the, in the eyes of the beholder but in the ears of the listener, you know, uh, for me music, what I like on music is, if I play music according to the mood I'm in. I don't just play music for play music uh, for sakes. I play music, music, in, in, so like if I'm sad, I can uh, play something maybe sentimental or maybe something even rock, Metallica or something, I don't know. Uh, if I'm happy, I'll play, of course, uh, happy music or maybe music maybe coming down or something. You know, it all depends on the feeling, on the mood, and what, what, uh, what you're going to play. In the, and everyone is different, you know, no two people are the same, you know, what one person likes is probably something horrible for the next person, and, you know, so it's very, very hard uh, to, to find the balance, uh, the mix, but uh, I'm 
working on it and I promise I will I shall have that list ready and uh, I shall post I shall make you a playlist on YouTube and uh, you can access it anytime you still having to go to iTunes and download the songs and pay for them which will be rather silly. By the way you can actually download music from YouTube which uh, you didn't hear it from me. Yeah, yeah, and uh, that was that was uh, that was a nice subject day, and uh, we'll be on to something totally different, and it's uh, very painful, very sad, very it's shocking. Uh, our good friend Matthew Lovett passed away recently, and uh, it was devastating, shocking. Horrible news. I mean, still trying to come to grips with it. A man, a young man, in the prime of his life, stripped away from us, stolen, robbed, moved on. It's not fair. It just doesn't make any sense. And uh, should be missed. We loved you all. Where you may be, you will always remember you, always think of you. And to Megan, Veronica, Megan's family, and Megan's friends, Matthew's friends, my deepest condolences to you. It's, it's, Sad stuff. Been down the street there, death in the family. I know how painful it is, how hard it is to to accept, to, to understand, to digest. It's uh, it, it, it takes time. You know, it, it takes time for you. You got to you got to give time. You got to give the time that is necessary. system because uh, it doesn't happen overnight. It takes time and you and you always have you find that during time that things keep reminding you of your lost one. I think there'll be something as city as be a shop seeing a toy or something. And you think, oh my god, this is the we had the same toy it was a plate and the memories come up, you know. And you just have to give it time and you have to Yes, it will hurt, but uh, that's, how, that's how life is, you know, as cruel as it sounds, but life is like that, you know, you've got to expect that things like this are going to happen during a lifetime, and, 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 and it's so cruel that it can be one brother, sister, mother, father, daughter, son, whatever, what, what, what can you do? I mean, this is nature, this is, this is, this is the part of the part of living, you know, there's nothing you can do about it, it's, you, know, you can choose to sit back and go into deep depression and be miserable for God knows how long, or you can choose that, you can choose to carry on living and say, yes, what can I do, I mean, uh, I, I still want to keep, keep living, I still got a life to you live in with and uh, and how painful things may be as how it is, you know. The person is gone, the person is gone. And you gotta grab life by the scruff of the neck and say, okay, you dealt us a very bad blow, bastard. But we have to move on, we have to keep living, we have to always remember the person, always love the person, always cherish the person. But uh, we as a person Onwards, you know, you know, go be so sad that you become depressed and it destroys your life as well. That's not the whole point. This is whole point is make sure that sadness, depression, uh, loss does not destroy your life as well. Don't let it, let it go that far. Grab it. It's like 
weeds in the garden. I'm going to grab them before they really get all of us up growing and then take over the whole garden when you grab them at an early stage. It's the same thing if you're sad and depressed. You want to make sure you have it under control. Your sadness, there's not too completely engulf you, it does not completely destroy you. This is something that's not cool.
try and find somebody to share this with. I mean, I know people, they pay a lot of money to go to psychologists, what have you. But you know, psychologists, about the fact that they're extremely expensive, they just listen. And they make you yourself, and inside yourself, find solutions to your own problems. They always just say, you'll be there and you'll give you some advice, maybe. But at the end of the day, it's you. It's you who's going to find the solution inside. Psychologists can't heal you physically, mentally. You can only just give you, you can only, you can only nudge you in the right direction uh, with you yourself. And don't trust me, tablets do not help. Uh, those tablets that psychologists give you sugar tablets, no medical effect whatsoever. And if he's giving you tablets that have medical effects, then my friend, you're suffering from mental illness. That's 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 the short and curlies of everything. So um, to be open and uh, what's going here? Somebody's flying past us once again here. Why this was not supposed to be a miserable video but uh, what can we do? You know, uh, when things like this happen, people. Yeah. And it's Friday anyway, so uh, we should cheer up. We should wake up. And. Yeah. I think that's about it. And uh, we shall see you next time when we make something. Yeah. Hopefully, we shave. Wearing the, the MIN truck hat, we'll make next video. So, uh, not about it. Thank you for watching. Thank you for your time, your oneness, your togetherness, your patience, and uh, we love you all. Bye bye.